an open essay to Triforce regarding his opinion on the Billy Mitchell punishment and whether Billy Mitchell cheated. Let me get this straight off the bat. Billy Mitchell lied. It is clear as day. It is documented in a film. He submitted that tape as an official submission for a high score in Donkey Kong. That tape in King of Kong that he hands to the old lady who's great at Cubit, that he turns over and that is submitted and put in as the high score on camera is fake. It was done on MAME, it was not done on an official arcade board, and Billy misrepresented and said it was done on an arcade board. Evidence is clear on that day. Not only was his submission to King, King of Kong, but his word from his own mouth on camera. Billy has never done a one million game in public, ever. Steve Wiebe was the first person to do a one million game in front of somebody. Steve Wiebe was also probably the first person to ever do a one million game on an official cabinet, but they didn't like the board, so they disqualified that score. He then turned up at an arcade and did it. But Steve Wiebe is the official Donkey Kong first one million scorer. Billy Mitchell lied. So, you know, in his own words, Billy Mitchell says it's from his own official Donkey Kong cabinet at home. Billy filed that statement. Billy gave it over. Billy said it was captured from original hardware with a two-bit converter. This is proven to be a lie. Now, Triforce, this is enough to get all of his records expunged. Yes, the footage Billy has submitted was shown not to have come from any gameplay cabinet. Any. They even tried all the fake cabinets they could. The two videos in question were shot from an emulator. Twin Galaxies does not say, well, say they're able to prove it's MAME, but they do not say that they... They do not say it's not MAME. They just say they can't prove it's MAME, but they can prove it's not a cabinet. Any cabinet. They even tried 16 in one boards, they tried 32 in one boards, and 16, 64 in one boards. They couldn't find any board from any cabinet using the ROM that that would have produced. So it came from a computer emulation, and Billy lied. You claim he's innocent of lies. He's not. He submitted it as an official tape. Therefore, with all the caveats that go along with that, and as he said in the film, which I'll probably cut to, Billy lied. Even facing the only, over, this overwhelming evidence, you continue to state that Billy is innocent. You don't state that he's innocent, you kind of dance around it like you're doing a jig. The lies against the rules, it's enough. Just the lies are against the rules. It's to ban him from life, not from just one record, but all of his eSport records to be wiped. Just like athletics, just like cycling. In athletics, if you're caught cheating on the shot put, you lose your 100 meters dash record as well. If you're caught in cycling, you lose your running record. It's happened in the past to people. If you're caught cheating in one sport, you're banned from all of them and all of your records are gone and you're banned for life. Ask Ben Johnson, sprinter, javelin thrower, gone. And yes, you, you, you know, you can have a look at Lance Armstrong. And yet, if Michael Jordan was caught in the last season he was ever playing, in just one match doing performance enhancing drugs, all of those six championship rings would have gone the way of the dodo. They'd have vanished. On that note, Billy Mitchell is now the Lance Armstrong of gaming. He was a cheat. His best friend was a cheat. Billy lied and wrecked his legacy. Twin Galaxies did not wreck their legacy. Billy wrecked his legacy by lying. Not anyone accused Billy wrecked his legacy? No, Billy wrecked his legacy. And you're only making it worse by dragging it out, by saying that he told the truth, and by twisting every single word anyone says to make it look like they're lying and Billy's telling the truth. You're lying, Triforce. You're lying by manipulation of other people's words. It's very open, it's very simple. Triforce, I wonder if you're scared and this ridiculous grandstanding and absolutely ludicrous position that you're taking on Billy Mitchell telling the truth and Billy Mitchell not cheating and maybe he didn't know they were unofficial cabinets is because maybe you're next. Any of your scores on unofficial hardware with the wrong settings or anything like that? Are you worried that you're going to come under the microscope soon? The community is going to be more vigilant and there are going to be more of these cases. And, you know, you're twisting everything up. Are you trying to create enough smoke so you can probably slip under the radar? Interesting position you've got, Triforce. Makes me think very long and hard about watching your videos. <laughs>